Oh yeah. There we go. He's gonna preen up some. Look at this guy. Do some more preening here. Fan that. Look at him stretch. Isn't that wonderful? What a beautiful stretch. The leg wings up. Look at that. What a wonderful. Okay, he's, there he goes. He's off on the flight. He chased the couple birds. Boy, they took off too. Here's our Merlin getting ready for his next flight. Kestrel came back and joined him. He's been really chasing these flickers. There he goes again. That's that flicker hollering for his life. Merlin's circling around. He's coming back to the perch. Ah, success. Our little bird caught something. It looked like it probably was a dragonfly. He just finished it up. You can see some of the colors on him now. This was the insect he had for a snack. I think it was a dragonfly. He's back on his lower hunting perch now. The stellar jays are coming in close. There's a couple of them in the tree next to him. Yeah, he's cleaning up his beak there. Getting some good sunlight now. Well, we'll see how he acts now. He's got a little bit of a snack, a little fuel in his belly now. Like I said earlier, he's been really chasing them flickers. That's the main birds he's been chasing today, so... We're just going to enjoy this guy sitting here in this great perch. We get a good view of him. The sunlight's good now. He looks like he's in pretty good focus. There he's bobbing his head. And like I say, he did get a little snack, so he might just uh, sit here long enough for us to make a little bit of a movie of him. We were rooting for him. Oh yeah, that flash there was a stellar day that came by. Now his little uh, Kestrel buddy was flying by too earlier. Okay, he's got two stellar jays in the tree with him. They've landed. Now back off a little bit so you can see them. There they are. You can see the size of the Merlin and the Stellar Jays are fairly close, so that'll give you an idea how big the Merlin is, because you get plenty of chances to see the Stellar Jays, but you don't see that many Merlins. So here is a good comparison in the tree, and you can see they're almost the exact same size. But they can't fly like this guy. This little Merlin is a little fighter pilot. He was zooming around here. He was very impressive. Looked like a miniature peregrine. Several stoops he'd ring up and you'd hear them flickers hollering, help, help, they were trying to get out of the way. Yeah, I imagine it was a pretty scary situation for him. I'll come back in on him now a little bit. There we go. There's our buddy. Ah, he got his tail in here. There we go. There he is, enjoying the sunshine and there he goes. He's off on the next hunt now. There he goes. He's coming around the clubhouse turn, going up along the fence. He scared out a flicker and he's coming back. You can hear him hollering. He's scaring them to death. He's going off to our left now. He's circling around. All right. Our Merlin's coming back to the tree. He land a little bit lower. See if we can get in on him. There he is. He did quite the hunt there. Well, we'll just keep an eye on him. He made a pass at a dove. There was a morning dove and uh, he darn near got it. So he made a couple of circles around, chased as far as he could and the dove went to cover so he circled around, came back to his perch, and there he goes on the next hunt. See, he's a busy guy. Made several good passes today. He's got a Merlin kind of hanging out. There he goes again, his other pass. He's really quick. Now the Stellar Jay has come in where the Merlin was. The Merlin flew out, and the Stellar Jay took his perch, and the Merlin's over here chasing the flicker. Sounds like a close call. The flicker's making a racket. All right, we'll keep an eye on him. All right, Merlin came back in. Right where I had it set before. There he is. Looks 
Looks like he's having a, quite the time today. Now well, there he is. He's just getting all set up. Back on his hunting perch, getting ready for the next flight. You can see the wind blowing a little bit. We definitely got a hungry Merlin today. He is chasing the flickers and everything else. There's some stellar jays in the area. But his main thing we see him chasing now was the flickers. And he's made several passes at them. A little Merlin. Usually he has a mate that hunts with him. I hear a woodpecker or something. There you go. He's after the flicker again. You can hear the flicker. Well, the Merlin caught himself a mouse or something. He was over by the Boeing Aerospace Pond and flew over here across the road, so. It was a rodent. Looks No, it looks like a small bird. All right. So he's made his catch. And he seems to be enjoying it now. So we're going to keep an eye on this little Merlin. And it's breakfast time and it's starting to rain. So we just got a glimpse of him and he sailed over here. And I followed him on the hunch and there he was in the tree. So. Kestrel, he's over there at the Boeing Aerospace Pond now and a couple of kingfishers, but we're interested in this guy here. There he is. Get a little bit on his face there. And he's just enjoying this small bird, looks like. See the little feet there. And this is our Merlin. And we're all excited about it. We'll keep a close eye on him. We see them every once in a while in the area, but uh, they're about the size of a stellar jay, and they look a lot like a kestrel, so you always got to be real careful when it's time to locate them.